Well, the pandemic has been hard on everyone this past year, especially those in the entertainment industry. And that's why Inland Northwest Opera Company decided to take their show on the road with a mobile opera truck. Photojournalist Dave Summers takes us behind the scene of this event happening tonight. It's a little crazy. Oh, so let me we might have bitten off more than we can chew. The key doesn't necessarily always want to turn, so you have to jiggle it in a very special way. This idea started at the beginning of COVID last year. I mean, right away, if you want a problem to be solved, you got to ask the artist. So how is it that we're going to get our product out to the public? We can't get them into us. We can't be indoors in theaters. <laughs> We started with operagrams, and last summer we were going to rent an opera truck. Um, we were going to rent a hay bale truck and, and pull it along and, and bring opera, um, but we had some troubles with uh, permits and a few things like that, and so we let it marinate all throughout the winter and said, you know, let's make this a real thing. So this folds in, the other one folds in, then the legs come off because you have to, you know, and then the whole thing goes inside. I think it's pretty awesome. Let's make this something we do every summer and let's take a mobile concert stage out to the entire Inland Northwest. So if you've never been in an opera hall, it doesn't matter. You can come and <laughs> just be outside at your neighborhood park and, and um, have the opera truck come to you. If you don't hear opera this summer, it's not our fault because <laughs> we're out and about everywhere and our job is to make opera accessible to everybody. By the way, the event or the mobile opera concert starts at seven o'clock tonight. Should be pretty cool.